What's up guys, it's your boy Darkskin, and today we're going to be going over something pretty interesting. Uh, before we get into the video, big shout out to the Naruto Blazing subreddit, and big shout out to Songluck for uh, posting it. Uh, Blazing News number 9 is out with new info regarding the second anniversary. So uh, let's go ahead and get into it. So in this round of Blazing News, we have a big announcement on uh, info, excuse me, on info uh, regarding the scheduled updates from now till the second anniversary. Late July update info birthday event is scheduled to be available. To welcome the birthday in July, a portion of that character will be featured in a banner. So pretty much somebody um, who's going to, I guess somebody whose birthday is in July, which I'll probably make another video talking about it or whatever the case may be. Um, also, from now on at any and at any time, character's birthday event is scheduled to be available. So pretty much, they're going to be celebrating characters' birthdays now. So let's celebrate with everyone. A new super impact will appear for impacts. The new super impact will certainly have the SS rank added when it appears. Additionally, the characters rewarded by the super impact will be 6-star and can be Blazing Awakened. Yo! So we're getting Blazing Bash impacts. Yo! I'm, I'm, I gotta drop a lot of videos today. Um... Guided missions are currently keenly under development. Certainly, please look forward to it. I'm uh, wow. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm just so like what? Anyways, Ninja World Class Questionable Scrolls implementation. Questionable scrolls will randomly appear during battle, and when picked up, something might happen. Activate random effects when you obtain the questionable scrolls that appear in Ninja World Class map. Depending on the effect, a great turnaround is also possible. So we now have special effects implicated into our PvP. And the special attacks mechanic impl implementation. Special attacks that strengthen characters' performances uh, when selected characters are drafted into the team on selected missions is scheduled to be, to be implemented. Special attacks related to obtaining um, of stats and rewards exist. Various special attack mechanics will be implemented into banner characters and characters rewarded from various content and will be easier to play. So pretty much, I'm assuming it's going to be like different teams. Like Team 7 is going to have a special attack, just different things like that. But um, guys, this, this is going to be like insane. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to do videos over each of these, um, talking a little bit more in depth and giving some speculation and stuff like that. But guys, like, the amount of, like, so many people have been talking about, yeah, man, Blazing needs to add something new. Blazing needs to do this. Blazing needs to do that. Well, Blazing is doing it. Like, yo, I'm just trying to think like that. Like, for birthday events, first, number one, birthday events, like, so pretty much we're going to have an event for every character that has a, a birthday event in Naruto. So like that's going to be like probably two or three times a month. So that's really crazy. Then going on to the super impact, we now can get uh, free to play units Blazing Awakened. Guided missions are currently uh, keenly under development, certainly. Please look forward to it. Yeah, but like so pretty much um, we're going to have Blazing Bash units that are free. Because, as you know, we have the regular impacts, which is just regular PvE units. But it's like, now we're going to have PvP units that you can obtain freely. That is insane. Yo, like... And then, um, the Ninja World Clash questionable scrolls or whatever. Um, it's pretty much going to be... What am, what am I trying to get at? Uh, questionable scrolls is pretty much going to be, um... There's going to be a scroll that pops up randomly, kind of like a chakra pot or a health pot in PvP. Uh, it's going to randomly pop up, and if you get it, something might happen. Now, I don't know if it's going to give you a stupid buff, like um, like if you, you get attack up, speed up, chakra up, or I don't know what is going to be the case on that specifically. But the fact that they are implementing that into PvP is really going to spice it up, because PvP has been kind of dull, and it's kind of been the same thing. It's literally been... You know, uh, Blazing Bash comes out, you summon for Blazing Bash, you win in PvP. You summon for Blazing Bash, you win in PvP. It's been like the same rotation. There's been nothing that's really crazy or out of the ordinary unless us ourselves have done it. Which, like, I've done body only and I've done element only PvP. A lot of people have been doing element only PvP. There's actually element only PvP um, tournaments going on. Which, uh, the last one was like a skill tournament that just ended or whatever. Shout out to my boy Kabuki and Mystic because they both participated in that. And Mystic was like third place, I think. So, pretty cool. Um, but yeah, so, like, that's gonna be, I, I hope, 
if they do it right that'll really spice up P pvp and make it a little more interesting but just as good as it could be it definitely could be just really broken and really op so i hope they don't make it op and busted to the point where it's unplayable like pvp kind of is right now but i hope that they actually do it in a really good way that it works uh going on like i said going on to the special attacks i made a video about this a while ago and people were telling me oh that's never gonna happen that's not a thing yada 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 um big shout out to the people that believed in me because we're getting special attacks now uh, apparently uh depending on like there's gonna pretty much um like i don't know if they'll be for old units but i know what it's saying for new units um say a banner drops right and the banner has naruto sasuke soccer on the banner if you pull those three units or have those three units in multiplayer on a team or whatever the case may be you'll have a special attack because you have those three people in the front row on a team right now like i said i don't know if that's going to pertain to the older units because as you know we do have the wisdom naruto skill soccer skill sasuke that was like the first official shippuden team we have um wisdom sakura skill sasuke and heart naruto as the first like pts team 17 uh i don't know what they're gonna do with those units or if they're just gonna keep it as uh we're only gonna put it for the units that come out after this update which either way, I don't care. I like it. I like they're doing. I like that they're doing something new. It's exciting. I I, I can't wait to see what they're gonna do with it. Um, and yeah, it's just like that's really really good. But anyways, uh, so that's gonna be it for this video. Be sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, comment down below, tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. With that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.